Hello, everybody. I hope you're all having a wonderful week. We are going. We have been talking about nature all this week, and I went on a nature walk and found a bunch of neat pieces of nature to bring in. And I'm going to be painting with nature today. So I have a leaf, some flower, a flowering plant, a flower with some leaves on it, and then a stick, okay? And I put a bunch of colors on a piece of, on a plate, a paper plate, or you can use um, maybe um, an egg carton that you want to recycle or um, anything flat, like so like, a, you know, a paper towel or something like that, that you can just kind of spread the paint out a little bit and let the, um, neat pieces of nature be able to get into the paint, right? So you want to give it a little bit of space. All right, so let's get into this. So I'm actually going to take my leaf first and with a little bit of orange paint, I'm going to pick it up and I'm going to maybe put it on this and push it down. I'm going to use it, maybe print, use it as a print and see what kind of print that makes. See? See, pick up a little bit more paint and maybe we can drag it. So we'll take it and drag it and see what that does. Okay. However you want to use your art materials. You push it down with your hand and drag it around. And then we can take maybe the yellow with our flowers and I'm gonna Use that. Yellow is a little hard for you to see on the screen, but I'm just using it and I'm going back and forth with my flowers. Right? Maybe use the flower with the leaves on it and side the purple paint and see what kind of flat picture that makes. Swirl it around my paper. Swirl, swirl, swirl. Just keep working on it, right? Simple, simple. Use your use what you have found in nature as your paint brushes. Now I also have just a stick right? A twig and it's got some green paint on it and I'm going to maybe make some polka dots. So one there, one here, one here, maybe one here. Maybe I can make some squiggles. Squiggle, 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 back and forth. Squiggle, 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 back and forth. Squiggle, 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 back and forth. Like that. However you would like. Just a little bit here, a little bit there. However you'd like to make this picture. I'm gonna take a little bit more yellow. I like the yellow in it. Looks very nice. And I'm gonna show you up close what this looks like so you can see how my pieces of nature have made a beautiful picture. So I'm going to bring it up close. And this could take as little and or as long as you would like to make. So here's my picture, my piece of artwork. Do you see how I used nature as a paintbrush to make my picture? See? See that? That's 
how you can use what you find maybe on a nature walk. You go outside and you go for a nature walk or you go to a park. Maybe you find some things out in the woods, um, on the ground. Maybe you find some flowers growing. You can take a little, little piece of the flower and kind of use that as a paintbrush. But these are things that you can do. And just a little bit of paint is all it takes and some paper. And you can spend some time creating a beautiful piece of artwork with nature. All right, so take your time as much or as little as you'd like and create this at home. It's really easy and I hope you all try it. Enjoy your week. Thank you for watching. Bye.